there, guys. So, right now, it is... 6.53 in the morning, so if I sound exhausted, I am very sorry, and my cat is meowing at me. So if you can hear her, do ignore her. Be quiet, Skitty. Me. Okay, sorry. Anyway, I am here to do my first Let's Play, which will be my university Let's Play. So as you can see, I've created my three sims right here. I'll show you them a little bit more later. And also, you might notice that I have a little bit of lag. I'm not sure how this is actually going to look. But I just don't have the best, like, recording software. So I'm going to be looking into getting, like, fraps or something for Easter. Because that's, like, $40. So, you know. Anyway, I chose Appaloosa Plains to, that they're going to live in. But then they'll go off to college, which I believe will take place in another, like, town kind of area. I'm not really sure. But I'm just going to buy them a house. So, yeah. Let me turn down my volume. Okay, sorry. Um, one, no, too small. I want to try to find, like, a two-bedroom, maybe, if they have one. I don't even know. Um, one bedroom. I think they're all one bedrooms. Yeah, they are. I'll put bunk beds in one of them. I'm just gonna purchase this one. Okay, so I'm very excited for this Let's Play. And today I'm going to be uploading two parts just because I want to. And it just came out and I think it'd be fun to get my channel started. You know, upload two parts. Okay, first thing that pops up says, check out your smartphone. Your phone has been upgraded and can now send text, use social networking scale apps, swap phone skins, and even has an improved camera. Be sure to use the new phone to check out the new social groups. Okay. So, I'm not going to learn about that. We're going to figure it out on our own. Let's see where the weather sound is real fastly. Fastly, I don't think that's the word. Um, okay, it's in this, like, random pond area. I don't even know. It's, I don't really like the weather stone. I mean, I guess it could be cool, but whatever, I don't like it. Okay, so I'm just going to do, like, a tiny little renovation. This is, like, going to be nothing, because they're going to go off to college, so I don't really want to do that much. Yeah, so. I'm going to move this over. And then for a bed, I am just going to buy... A bunk bed. Where are the We're gonna get this one. And then I'll buy Oh, this came okay, sorry, I'm getting distracted. That's a new bed, but I'm gonna try not to get distracted right now. And where's a single bed that matches? Here it is. Okay. <laughs> that has enough sleeping room. Let me just move this over. Right there. Okay, so I think that's good enough for now. Okay, so I just recorded this whole little next section of this part, and then it did not end up recording. So I will be doing it again. Basically, I just introduced the Sims, and I enrolled them in college, so I'm just going to go introduce them again. So this is Brooke Spain. I'm not sure if I can really get a good shot at her, because she's, like, standing behind the mailbox. But she's just really laid back, you know, she kind of wanted to go to college, but she's just kind of feeling the whole, sorry, I just like knocked my iPod, okay, she's just really chill and, you know, calm, she doesn't get really stressed about tests, she doesn't care about grades or anything like that, she's just kind of laid back, and her traits are couch potato, avant-garde, I believe is how you say it, irresistible, heavy sleeper, and artistic. So, she has two new traits. She has the avant-garde trait, which is like street art type trait. And irresistible, which kind of makes sense. You know, like, irresistible, like, the. I don't really have to explain that to you. And her lifetime wish is street credible. So, it says, for a street artist armed with a spray cam, the world is our canvas waiting to be painted. It takes a keen eye and a steady hand to create masterful art on the walls and ground. But a street artist wouldn't have it any other way. So, yep, that's what she wants to do. And this is Natalie. Okay, where's Natalie? You're standing behind her. <laughs> Go here. Okay. So that's what Natalie looks like. She is a nerd. And I love her. She's, like, adorable. Uh, I didn't really like the nerd clothes that they had in Creative Sim. 
So I just gave her this sweater, very adorable, and the jeans are from Diesel, and everything but the jeans are university, so even her hair, but the jeans are Diesel, and the shoes too, they're cute. And I forgot to tell you, her clothes, everything is university, except for the hair. Her hair is from the Sims 3 store, and her shoes are showtime. Anyway, back to Natalie. Natalie? Uh, yeah, she's cute. So her traits are Supernatural fan, because I figured that, you know, she likes reading books, and fantasy books are quite her cup of tea. So, um... Yeah, she's a Supernatural fan for that reason. She's socially awkward, which is a new trait, so, you know, that kind of explains itself. She's socially awkward, and she's a nerd, and, you know, she's funny. And she's a genius, again, nerd, perfectionist, and a computer whiz. So, yeah, those are her traits. And her lifetime wish is perfect student. Earning a university degree is an, ac is an accomplishment, ac I can't talk, is an accomplishment all in itself. But to earn one with a perfect GPA takes as much brawn as it does brains. Late nights will be spent studying. Of course it goes away. <laughs> Late nights will be spent studying. And a little luck will be needed to pass exams. But it's worth it for a perfect GPA. And our last sim that I made. This is Lydia. So she is the rebel. I love her. I love her outfit. It came with um, university. And her shoes came with the university too. She is adorable, and her hair is a Sims 3 store, but I, I, I adore her. She's cute. So she is rebellious, which is a trait that came with Generations. Brooding, which came with Supernatural. Great Kisser, which is base game. Night Owl, which is Supernatural. And Party Animal, animal which is base game. And yeah. And her lifetime wish is the home design hotshot, which did not come with University. The other two did, but this one doesn't. So, yeah, I'm not going to read that one because it's an old one, but yes. So, they're just going to go off to college right now. Oh, and I have not told you what they're majoring in. So, Lydia is a business. Let me see if it tells me. Will it tell me? Okay, maybe not yet. She's in the business major. Natalie is the science and medicine. And Brooke is art. So that's kind of where her traits come from. They, I tried to get them to all match. And yeah, I recorded that part. I can't remember if it had like messed up before that. So that's going to be it for this part. It was probably a pretty short part, but I'm sorry. <laughs> so yeah, and I'm uploading the next part today. So there'll be two parts up. And I just hope you enjoyed this part. Pretty please subscribe and support me. I would definitely appreciate it. So, um, goodbye, guys. Peace. Bye. Awkward. Okay, goodbye.